All right, I'm gonna do a quick little video showing how to set up a bot and how to change the percentage profit like I showed in my last video where I set this one for 0 0.02, the next one for 0 0.10, and the next one for 0 0.25. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over and for the purpose of this, we'll select BTC USDT. Okay. And you're going to click create a bot. Now, uh, go bot house. For this one, we're just going to click regular grid bot. Now, if you use the AI strategy, it puts the range right there, has 50 grids, you can see that's 0 0.4 to 0 0.57, and you would need at least $84.13 to create this bot. So if you click set myself, let's put the lower limit at 11,500, upper limit 12,500. Okay, so right here, on grids, we can top in 10. 10 grids would be 0.83% every single time it buys or sells. So 0 0.59, 0 0.49, 0 0.36, 27, 19. So let's get, yeah, if we jump up to 55, it's 0 0.05, 0 0.04. Now, remember, every single time you add a grid, you're breaking your money down into smaller and smaller trades. So your risk level really does go down because it's going to just sit there and bounce and bounce and bounce and bounce, and it'll be able to DCA you back into profit but that's why I'm doing the test to see what is the most profitable setting because I honest to God don't know. So is it best to have, you know, the super scalper setting of, you know, 0 0.02 or would it be better to get 0 0.25, 0 0.5, you know, every time it moves half a percent, every time it moves 1%. So... You really do just, this is how you play with it. And the more trades you get in there, it will change. So you see right here, you need $98.94 to create this one. Whereas if you do 12, you only need $28.48. So that's the minimum you have to have to create this bot. And then what I was also talking about, so trigger price. So see, it's at 12033 right now. Say you want to wait till it dips down to 11750 You would top that in right here. 11750 And let's say you want to close this, take all your profit and walk away as soon as it goes outside your range. So you could top that right here. It's just got to be at least one penny over or if you're dealing with fractions of a penny just one number above what the top of your grid is just go one number beyond that on stop loss or close a bot and you can set all that up right there i was putting that in the wrong one anyway so you would just put 12 i think i said 500.01 and as soon as it hits that, it'll shut this bot down. That way you can keep your profit, walk away. Otherwise, it'll leave the bot running. So say Bitcoin goes up and then comes back down. As soon as it comes back down, it's going to reactivate your bot. It only does trades as long as it's within your grids. So I appreciate y'all dropping the comment. Feel free to ask any more questions, anything else y'all want to know. I will be happy to either find out the information and make a video about it, or I'll be happy to just make a video and show y'all 
how this thing works, what to do. But anyway, thank you all for your support and feel free to uh, post a comment. Let me know what you'd like to see more of. And if uh, there's anyone out there who, you know, knows more about this than what I know, feel free to make a video and link it on my chat because I would love to learn from someone more knowledgeable than me. And I don't mind supporting uh, fellow YouTubers. So even if you're just starting off, feel free to just drop a comment and I'll check it out. Catch you on the next.